Hey everybody, Haku here with yet another Loot Crate unboxing. This actually might be a way better place to record it now that I've got this second setup here that I can record with. Um, yeah, I actually think this is going to be a way better place uh, for this video because I'm at my desk. I have a whole desk here to uh, put everything on and everything like that. Uh, but either way, sorry I found a little bit quieter, maybe not with the same energy as usual, if even that. Uh, but I'm recording this a bit late at night before going to bed. But either way, I wasn't expecting this today. I'm super excited to get into it and see what we have going on. Uh, from the bottom, it says that this is the July 2019 um, core Loot Crate. Uh, so yeah, as usual with these videos, huge thank you to Loot Crate for making it possible for me to do them. Uh, and also, if you want to have whatever is going to be in the uh, next Loot Crate, then uh, if you want to sort of get a good deal on it. Uh, if you want to help the channel, use LootCrate.com slash Haku, but either way, whether you do that or not, uh, using code Haku will get you 10% off, so uh, yeah, definitely go get yourself a deal if you're looking into getting a Loot Crate. Uh, so yeah, either way, let's open this up and uh, see what we get this time around. Um, so yeah, let's get into this. Oh, this is oh, it's mystery machine on the inside. I uh, I love Scooby Doo. Something that not a ton of people know. Ah, oh, yes, me and my friend discussing uh, Scoob lore all the time. I I love Scooby Doo. So we have a Scooby Doo pen. This is great. Wonder if the shirt's gonna be related to that as well. Oh nope. Ah, oh, this is nice. Oh god, I'm at to hold this up in front of me in front of the camera. Visit Friendly Neighborhood Queens, I think it says. A Spider-Man shirt. Friendly Neighborhood of Queens. I love it. This is great. Again, hitting with series that I like. I'm a big Spider-Man fan, big Scooby-Doo fan. Now, I haven't seen the Aquaman film yet, but we have something here from Aquaman as well. There's a lot in this. And a lot of cool stuff. Hang on, let me get through it. Oh, what? Ooh. Oh. I do like Black Manta, though. As a DC fan... At least comics and cartoons wise. Black Man on one side and Aquaman on the other. I like this. I like this a lot actually. I'm a big Black Man fan actually. <laughs> oh, and this looks like. Hang on, we have. Oh, we have another thing too. Before we get to the thing that I'm seeing in here that looks like it could be the best thing of them all, uh, let's. How do, I, how do I get this out without uh, trying to make sure I don't hurt the goods, you know? It it comes in this tube where at first I was like, ah, did they just place a um a t one of these in here to make it so that stuff didn't bounce around? But no, there's looks to be some sort of poster in it. But I'm trying to get it out while still being gentle. I don't want to uh, don't want to harm whatever it is in here. All right, let's see what we get. Un unroll this. Oh, I like this. I like this if I can... Oh, man, this is probably a mess on your ears. Oh, I like this. Ugh. Again, more Scoob. I love it. I love this a lot. Because, as I said... And I've said it in a lot of... Oh, it's, it's weird enough. I've said it in, like, past anime videos and stuff, how much I like Scooby-Doo, and how, for some reason, Scooby-Doo inspired a lot of the certain things that I like in shows and such, even with anime. It's a, it's a very weird one, I must say. Oh, this is nice. This There's a sticker as well. All right. Farscape sticker. Cool, cool. And then... Okay, just making sure if this is the last thing before I bring it out, and it is, I'm really liking this. Oh yes, this is Fallout Brotherhood of Steel Power Armor. Fallout, I mean, I mean, we know the mess that 76 was, but aside from that, Fallout is one of the game series, I think, that has inspired my love of sort of, sort of open world RPGs, Fallout 3, kind of changed the game for me. It was one of the first sort of games like that I ever played on the uh, Xbox 360. So, um, yeah, Fallout 3 to this day is one of my favorite games because of that, because it had such an impact on, like, young middle school me. Um, oh, yeah, let's open this, see what we get. 
Sorry, I'm going to try to hold this a little bit away from the mic. I don't want, um... Oh, man, this looks really good, too. Okay, hold on. I'm trying not to give you that plastic crinkling ASMR too, too much. This is cool. I like this a lot. All right. So we have the base taped in here and uh, the actual power armor. I like this a lot, actually. Actually, let me take a quick jump cut and I'm going to put this thing together to show it off. All right. Now look at the detail on this guy. I love this. I like this a lot. Like I said, I'm a massive fan of Fallout. This is insane. He has his little, his little, um, gosh, the little pipe rifle as well. The detail on it is really great, though. Let me show around the back of it. It's a little unsteady and unstable on the base. He'll be fine sitting on like a shelf or something, but uh, just holding him like this, it feels like he's gonna fall off the base. I like the little uh, vault door looking base. It's got a little bit of rust look to it. This, I think, it's safe to say, Loot Crate has sent me some really, really cool stuff in the past, but with this, this has got to be the best one by far. If only because I love this, um, this little Fallout figure, and in addition to loving that, they sort of nailed it with all series that I really, really enjoy. Spider-Man, Scooby-Doo, uh, even got me a um, Aquaman, the, uh, the Black Mana um, coin. So yeah, also one last thing before I end this. Let me move this box over out of the way. Uh, one last thing before I end this video. Taking a look at the inside of the, uh, of the box. Because you can flip it around and make a little mystery machine. And I, again, I love that. I love that uh, even the boxes always have some sort of interesting thing you can do with them or make them into or something like that. Uh, but yeah. This was this was good. This was the best. Um, if just for this this Fallout guy, I love it. I love it so much. Uh, but yeah, either way, I'm gonna end this here. Not drag on the video too much longer than necessary. Um, but yeah, I I really really love all this stuff. So huge, massive, incredible. Thank you uh, to Loot Crate for this one. I'm so glad that I got this one in particular because all this stuff is great. Um, but yeah, if you want to see, there will be a link to the other unboxings for Loot Crate that I've done. Um, in, well, I can just put a link to it in the comments. I have them all in a playlist that you can find. Uh, but they've sent me some really, really, really cool stuff in the past. And if you want to get in on it, subscribe to Loot Crate yourself. Like I said, um, if you want it, if you want your subscription to go toward helping the channel a bit, um, then LootCrate.com slash Haku. But either way, the part I care about to save you a bit of money, 10% um, off with code Haku. Just simple, Haku. H-A-K-U. Simple. Uh, but yeah, that is it. Thank you so, so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that. And uh, I'll see you all next time.